This video will explain how to set up your TSP-103 LAN printer. Let's start by downloading the driver from the StarMicronics global support site. The link is in the description below. For the product type, select TSP-100 Future Print. Then, save Future Print version 7.2 Lite to your PC. Once downloaded, open the driver folder and extract the files. Or, you can right-click on the folder and extract the files. To do this, simply click the Extract button. Once the extracted folder is open, right-click the Auto Run X file and run as the administrator. Cancel the install of the Direct Play. Select Installation and Accept. Continue to click Next, and then you will have the option to install the driver. Once the installation finishes, select Finish. The Starry Cloud Services website will then open. Here, you can register your business to be able to provide customers, digital receipts, and other customer engagement and device management tools for your business. At this point, make sure the printer is connected to your router using an Ethernet cable. The cable will go from the Ethernet port on the back of the printer labeled 100 slash 10 base to your router. Turn the printer off. Then, while holding the feed button, turn the printer back on. Continue to hold the feed button until the printer begins to print. Two pages should be printed, and there you will find an IP address at the bottom of the second page with the letters DHCP in parentheses. Once you have that IP address, you can continue with the driver install. Make sure that your PC is connected to the same router as the printer. Then select the Windows button and search for the LAN and Bluetooth setup tool. Another option is to select Programs, then Star Micronics, then TSP100, and lastly, LAN and Bluetooth Setup Tool. Once the Setup Tool loads, it will search the network for the printer. Once it finds the printer, select Configure on this page and the IP address highlighted. The printer web interface will then open and ask you to change your password. This can be done at any time, so for now, click Cancel and continue to select IP Parameters and then select Static. The IP address, subnet, and default gateway should all stay the same. Then click Submit and a message will appear telling you that it was accepted. Now click Save and then click Execute to continue. A confirmation page will print and the printer will restart. Now let's go back to the LAN and Bluetooth setup tool. Quick Discovery to find the printer again. Select Print Queue. Then check the Print Test page box and then Apply. The driver will then install and print a Windows test page. Congratulations, your TSP-103 LAN printer is now set up for Windows. If you are setting up a TSP-100 LAN printer, follow these instructions. Select Configure and uncheck the Dynamic box. Then click Apply and then Yes. It will say Complete and a small page will print from the TSP-100 LAN printer. Quick Discovery to find the printer again. Select Print Queue. Then check the Print Test page box and then Apply. The driver will then install and print a Windows test page. Congratulations, your TSP-103 LAN printer is now set up for Windows. For additional information or support, please visit the website in the description below or contact our technical support team.